people are confused as the attitude of the authorities towards extraterrestrial aliens is not yet clearly defined. And what if they arrive? A couple of spacecraft of unknown origin will land near the White House on Red Square, Beijing, Tokyo. Representatives of extraterrestrial civilization will come out of them and all will say as one, people, are you stupid or what? Have you unexplored space? You have unexplored space, the great mysteries of the universe are undiscovered, and you threaten each other with nuclear weapons without even leaving your cradle, quote unquote. There is such a theory that there is limited intelligent life capable of traveling through the vast expanses of space because the majority destroy themselves due to some stupidity or greed. That is, ETs, aliens capable of flying to the earth and saying that we are here, are more likely to be a non-aggressive race than does, that does not want to enslave humanity. On the other hand, there are also not obliged, they're not obliged to save us from ourselves. Many believe that at the very peak of human conflict, some observers, quote unquote, will land on earth and instantly stop all conflicts. In religions, this would be called the second coming, the return of the gods, merging with a single cosmos, and so on. But the essence is always the same. Someone, and for some reason, must save us because we have some kind of value for universe. And if it's like Douglas the Hitchhiker Guide to the Galaxy, there the aliens paved the way through space and the earth interfered with them. So they took and demolished the entire planet without even asking humans. What's the point of saving us if we can't save ourselves? There is logic for aliens to show their latest technologies and achievements in medicine if some on earth still believe that an idol or a, magic, ma a magician spell will save them from troubles. For them, we are like Papuans who have never seen cell phones and helicopters. We have no way out. There are already 8 billion of us and the bourgeois broke their heads. How to get rid of the extra 7 billion? War, as they understood, was an option, and on the right scale, affected everyone, the pandemic didn't work, space remains, and now the whole world will once again turn its eyes to the starry sky. And the point is not even whether there are aliens or not, but that they will be declared to be demons and servants of Satan, because somehow a person was created in the image and likeness of God, and then some reptilians will alive, arrive, the entire religious flock will definitely collapse, from such a shock wave, perhaps people will be fooled for thousands, have been fooled for thousands of years that they are the crowns of creation and everything will be fine with them and then gray aliens will fly in and spoil the party for us. This is all hypothetical, of course. Judging by what's happening, it's quite possible that they have not just arrived but are even already here. Of course, the article is more satirical or humorous, but in every joke, joke, as they say. And this is on Soul Ask. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I really support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.